Okay, so I'm going to have you um, repeat some of the exercises we've done. Uh, you were treated for tennis elbow with injections, and you got better, but you still had some pain in the forearm, and you got clumsy, less strength. Is that correct? That's yes? Correct. Okay. So now what we're going to do is I'm going to have you extend your wrist, and you're going to resist me as hard as you can, okay? One, two, three. Whoops. No power. Now we're going to do the same thing on the other side. Extend the wrist and resist as hard as you can. Lack of power. Now you're going to extend the arm, and you're going to... Uh, deviate your wrist this way and you're gonna resist I'm gonna push towards me you resist me okay one two three no power same thing on the other side Wrist this way resist as hard as you can no power okay do you happen to have pain right over here yes, yes you do I'm not gonna do any of the other side because I know you have I pain know. okay so now we're gonna do the scratch collapse test you're gonna keep your elbows like this I'm gonna push this way and you're gonna rotate outward so you so the wrist shouldn't move okay resist you have power i'm going to scratch you right here resist me whoops no more power that's a positive uh, scratch collapse test okay so now you resist okay perfect i'm scratching you here over the radial tunnel and then you resist again and whoops the power is gone so now we're going to repeat this and i'm going to use a use a cold spray to numb the skin it's cold and we're repeating the same thing. I'm scratching you over here. Resist. Congratulations, you're strong again. Yes. <laughs> this is a positive scratch collapse test Magic. with um, a positive uh, response to cold spray. <laughs>